Hi, so I've been asked by Huang uh, uh, Ringgold. Uh, he wanted to know if I could make a video explaining how to draw the Steve Houston bullet. Uh, there's a body formula that I tend to use, which I took from uh, my figure drawing teacher, Steve Houston. Uh, he wants to know if I could use, show how this bullet formula um, can be applied to dynamic drawings, dynamic poses. So that's what I'm going to do in this video. Hi, my name is Luis Escobar. I'm a storyboard artist on the Simpsons television show. I've been working on the show for over 20 years now. And so um, just really quickly, I wanted to talk about what the bullet is. So I have this body formula lesson on my website, the drawingwebsite.com. There will be a dis uh, link to this page on the description of this video. So I was kind of going over what the uh, different types of ways of drawing uh, bodies are. And the uh, one of the things is the bean is one body type that you can, uh, body formula you can use. And then there's the bullet, which is kind of like a more advanced version of the bean. And of course the bean is two balls stuck together and it can be mushed around and stuff like that. And then there's the bullet, which is a little bit more advanced. And it's called the bullet because there's this bullet shape here that is actually the abdominal muscles. And when turned like three quarter, you can see that this is the abdominal muscles. And then you have like this skirt shape for the hips. And then with this, you can make a little bit more um, realistic looking torsos uh, out, of, out of this bullet shape. And then uh, there's this hip area where I just kind of, it's called the hip underwear. I just, and, and you can make uh, characters like this, you know. And here's an example of using the bullet to draw, say, an anime style. Uh, dude, I can barely see it. But, um, let's see if I can't zoom in. So here's how to use the bullet to draw, like, say, an anime-style body for male and how to draw use the bullet to draw a female body. All right. So that's what we're going to be talking about. And um, just, just to make a dynamic poses, dynamic body parts, how would I apply that bullet shape to something that's more malleable? And... That's pretty much drawing for me. That's what I do. This is uh, everything when I when I when I'm drawing. This is the only thing that I that I draw. So uh, this is how I draw. Any kind of pose can be used. Can, you could use the bullet for. So in essence, uh, just come up with a pose uh, if. So let's 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 try here. Let me let me increase so you can see what I'm doing. So let's say we have a character. So let's do that. Or and then maybe one character is doing this. Another character like that, and like this. So notice that what I'm doing here is kind of like the bean and kind of like the bullet so this would be the the abdominal muscle area uh, again the 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 bullet shape is in essence a flat top kind of like that and then 
like a skirt for the hips. Okay, so what these are is this cylinder, but I'm not as well defined, so. The cylinder up here, but bent. The cylinder up here. cylinder there okay so once we have that we have our bullet shape we could draw the skirt and the crotch area here And the hip underwear. Okay. Hip crotch. So, yeah. Different dynamic poses. Crotch area. legs, arms, whatever the head's actually doing. Dynamic poses for the bullet, how it actually is applied in these rough drawings here you could see that after this point at this point you've pretty much got and then you just start refining you know start finishing up your drawing but this is pretty much where I start I start drawing something like that and then maybe these heads are way too big and then I just have to start adjusting But in general, this is how I start 
that's that's how I would approach drawing uh, dynamic poses using the 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 bullet shape. Do you see? It's not too it's not that complicated. You can just just think of it like you it's like as if it's Play-Doh and just move it around and then draw the details on top of that the 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 construction the the pecs the way the pecs work etc you put your anatomy on there uh the anatomy is a completely different lesson you would have to learn uh how what goes where etc but the basic foundation of the the skirt and the bullet and that sort of thing that's it's pretty simple it's pretty straightforward okay so I hope that answers your question Juan and um, yeah that would be what I have to say about that if you like this video um, I want to invite you to become a patron uh, one of the reasons why one of the big benefits that I'm gonna be doing uh, coming up soon so I'm going to create another tier, a $100 tier. <gasps> $100, yes, because what it is, is that for $100 a month, uh, five people, and I'm going to limit it to about five because I can't do more, um, I'm going to give, co I'm going to start to coach. I'm going to give coaching uh, lessons to five individuals. Those five individuals, what they will get is I'm gonna we're gonna we're gonna talk via Skype or whatever it is. I'm gonna find out what you need specifically to be to improve. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm going to uh, uh, create assignments for that person so that uh, they could improve. And then they will do the assignment, and then I will critique it, and I will send them a video critique to help them improve and then they could ask me questions back and forth and, and 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 build up the skills build 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 up what uh you want and you can do this for as long as you want and uh until you get to the point where you want to or you no longer want to pay and you or you just want to take it from there okay so that's a benefit that i'm going to be doing on my patron uh, on my on my patreon campaign so that's going to be a new tier and i'm going to create another tier on top of that that's going to be at a 40 dollars level where you could actually see those critiques so that if you can't get and become one of these people you could at least get the critiques and learn from what they're learning how they're learning maybe do the assignment yourself and then see if your what you're doing uh compared to what they're doing etc cetera, etc cetera. so um, you can learn from all everybody's critiques. You can learn from everybody's um, what I'm telling them that they could improve on, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Now, some of these critiques will be put into the channel, in this channel, just parts of them. Um, but and I'm still going to be answering questions and making book reviews and other things like that. But uh, if you want to be part of the part of the first five people. Um, I highly recommend you start off just being a patron on my site at a $1 level because I'm going to give my patrons the first first dibs. So whoever wants to be uh, in that coaching class, if the, whoever wants to be drawing, whoever wants a drawing coach, uh, they will get first dibs. And again, there's only five spaces. However, People will be, it, it'll be, you know, they'll want to participate for the first four weeks and then that'll be it just for that one month. Or they may go on for two or three months, but eventually um, that's, that's what it's going to be. Now, uh, the first, f uh, for the first three months, uh, the first five people will actually get a discount. Uh, so the tier will only be $80 for the first five for the first three months i'm sorry so for the first three months those first five people are only going to pay 80 and then after the first three months then it's going to go up to 100 okay so um and because it's going to go to 100 maybe someone will, some people will drop out 
So just um, just to be aware of that. And on top of all that, you also get all the other benefits that come with being a patron. So uh, if that sounds interesting to you, I highly recommend you at least start at a hundred dollar level. I mean, at, at a dollar level, so that you can participate and have uh, first dibs, uh, uh, be one of the first people to sign up for that coaching. All right. I'm only doing it for, again, limiting it to five people and uh, because it's going to be a lot of work for me. But depending on how well it goes and how how it is, uh, I may ex I may open it up for more people. I don't know. So just give you a heads up if you want to improve your drawings on your own. All right. So I hope this has been helpful. I hope this explains a little bit more of the bullet. If you want to know a lot more about the bullet, I highly recommend you go to that lesson on my drawing website. And I will see you next time. All right. Bye.